Hello everyone and welcome back to another week of greatness. Today is a little bit different. I will be speaking to you about bullying, what, what is bullying, what is not bullying, the types of bullying, its effects, resolutions, preventions, and how we can move forward. My name is Jada Strawn. I'm the founder of the Anti-Bullying Club. Take out a book and a pen because we will be getting right into this lesson. Let's get into it. So first, I would like to start with my personal story um, to appeal to you guys' heart about bullying. So in primary school, that's when my first case of bullying started to happen. I didn't have the most perfect teeth. I have book tooth and students took advantage of that. In primary school, you know, students are not aware of emotions and people's feelings and so they took advantage of that um they called me names like buck tooth spongebob tea army tea and much more um so with that it really lessened my self-esteem it made me want not wanting to be around other people it basically ex excluded me from other people <laughs> I was afforded the opportunity by my aunt to get braces and I have bought braces for about four to six years and this what this did when my teeth was straightened it helped me gain self-confidence in myself and I started and I wanted to do something with myself after this and I told myself I want to join a pageant to show myself that I am confident about who I am now as a person and so I joined the pageant I won the pageant I won a little title in it and what this did to me it helped me so when I went into high school I joined another pageant I didn't win that pageant but with my platform as bullying um, my mom and my guidance counselor told me that I shouldn't start something and don't do something about it and so that's when I started the anti-bullying club in 2015 where we raised awareness to bullying in high schools so in considering all of this, we must know what is bullying and what is not bullying. So first let's start with what is not bullying. Um, bullying is not when two people have an altercation or they just arguing or have a disagreement. So if you see two friends out and they start arguing, don't please do not cry bullying because it is not bullying most of the time. But bullying is when your act towards another person is threatening, demeaning, and negative consistently. So if you see a person always on your friend about something, they're taking money from them, they're threatening them, they're hitting them, abusing them all the time, that is bullying. So your action towards a person must be consistent. It cannot be where they did it one day and that's it. Bullying happens over a period of time. Hi, my name is Jarelle Strawn and I'm the co-founder of the Anti-Bullying Club. So whenever I do a presentation or I'm making like a statement to someone who doesn't really know much about bullying, I always mention the term BPCC. And this just simply represents the four types of bullying, which is verbal bullying, physical bullying, covert bullying, or cyber bullying. So the first type, which is V, it stands for verbal bullying. And this is just the name calling. When you call somebody a bad name, whether stupid, dumb, you're so ugly, that is what it represents. So the next part of VPCC is P, which is physical bullying. And this includes the hitting, the pinching, the kicking, all of that that is physically attacking someone. Next we have covert bullying and this is just excluding someone or damaging someone else's reputation and then lastly we have cyber bullying and this is done over the internet and as you guys know coronavirus has been present in 2020 and the rise of cyber bullying is present so be mindful when you log into the internet to please watch out what you're saying to people during this time especially during quarantine back to you jada so let's tell a difference who is the bully and who is not the bully who's the victim so most of the time bullies are people who always get in fights they are always in trouble always sent to the principal's office they always have aggressive behavior towards people. Um, 
if you see them always have extra belongings that probably isn't theirs and most of the time they blame others for their mistakes and the victim and the victim um if you see they always have injuries or they have personal belongings is destroyed or they have body illness they have low self-esteem trouble going to sleep and basically excluding themselves away from people so jada when did your confidence allowed you to start the anti-bullying club organization itself so after i would have gotten my braces and my teeth would have straightened already um i sort of wanted to do something to help me um realize that i have confidence in myself so most times people go in pageants and they do not follow up with what they're doing and so this encouraged me and i was able to get in contact with my vice principal and the guidance counselor who told me about club day and club day is when various organizations in the school get together and they form and basically recruit people for their organization and so i did that and that's how the anti-bullying club started how was the response from the school when you started the organization so um i've known a lot of people in my school um i've had a lot of friends like who were close like the public system we are very close as friends and stuff like that so i get a bunch of my friends and we all got a table me and my sister decorated the backdrop for us and we sat very patiently and calm waiting for people to come um we also gave out bonds to the students and fortunately we got a lot of people who came and support us even in club meetings we had where the senior mistress of my high school brought in troubled students and people who were caused um, trouble around the school would come to the meetings and we just had a great turnout and I'm so grateful of that. What can students expect when they join the organization or when they join a meeting? So at our anti-bullying club meetings, um, they are very serious and straight to the point. We do not love to waste time. We talk to students about empathy, sympathy, and stuff like that. How they can be in other people's shoes. How to know who is the bully. How to know who is the victim of bullying. How to deal with bystanders. How to conquer and deal with bullying. Also explain the four types of bullying, what is bullying, the problems it have on people, the effects, how to prevent it and stuff like that. It's not always serious. We do have fun times and activities to go through certain situations. So let's talk about the effects of bullying. So for me, like I told you guys before, I had low self-esteem. I was excluded from other people. In people's journey of bullying, they always have low self-esteem about themselves and they exclude themselves from others. They are sad all the time. Um, they try to make excuses for things that happen to them um, and much alike. Who to report bullying to? So if you have a friend who's being bullied or if you are being bullied, you can speak up to someone. There are people there to help you in this time. You can go to a police, you can find a therapist, you can go to a guidance counselor, even a pastor or you can even come to me a bully advocate so with that being said anti-bullying club is on facebook you can hit us up tell us your stories we'll help you go through the process with you so bully advocates are people who stand up to fight against bullying and to eradicate it in the society or in high schools or in the youth itself so we have certain celebrities who are standing up against it like Katy Perry, Demi Lovato, Celine Dion, Nick Cannon and now you. Bullying has long lasting effects it doesn't just travel for one time but it travels for a long period of time so when you go throughout this remember to consider other people's feelings and emotions do unto others what you would have them do unto you that's the golden rule and through all of this we want you to remember to stand up for yourself speak up for someone else and look, look up, up because help is here, here.